lot of books here. All right, we're gonna try it. Oh God, this is heavy. Oh my gosh, this is so heavy. Oh, I did it. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. Okay. Oh gosh, I broke a sweat a little bit. So I would have unboxed this on camera, but I'm very impatient. So I have been eyeing these book covers from Nerdy Ink for maybe about a year now, and I finally got them. So oh, all my books just fell on the floor. So just a side note, I just finished filming a video for my main channel, and I didn't realize until the very end that my entire front of my eyelash was not glued down. So that was fun. <laughs> so hopefully now my lashes look glued down. Let's hope everything goes smoothly, minus the books falling, but you know, just bear with me here. <laughs> As I was saying, I saw these covers about a year ago and I just didn't get around to buying them and I finally did. I got them last week. So let me show you guys what exactly they look like. This is beautiful. I love that they're all white based backgrounds. Um, they look really good on my shelf. So this is Throne of Glass, and then this is the back of Throne of Glass. The art is just so beautiful, I love it. The inside has the maps. Sorry, my nails aren't done. Half of the other map here. And the actual inside, this gold star outline. I'll show you the Assassin's Blade, even though that's not the order that I would recommend reading it in. This is the front. Obviously it has Sam on it. Back. The spine. And then the interior is map. Then the map. And we have Crown of Midnight, Dorian on the front. Again, it has the map on the inside. Here's Air of Fire with Ronin on the front. This art is just so gorgeous. Back. I absolutely love Manon, so this is one of my favorite covers. So it's Manon and Abraxas on the front. These maps This is the only dust jacket that has, um, that doesn't quite fit the book. It's a little bit too big, but it's okay. We'll make it work. We have Empire of Storms. map two and then tower of dawn don't mind the bookmark i'm in the middle of this book the back of this one half the map here and the other half of the map Ooh, where am i there we go kingdom of ash which is gorgeous I absolutely love, love, love the art of all of these dust jackets. I think that they give so much more personality to the books. So I am reading the series for the very first time. I'm almost done. I am finishing up Tower of Dawn and then I am starting Kingdom of Ash pretty much immediately after. And I dedicated a shelf to the series. So it, it's really going to look so nice on top of my shelf. The paper quality is really, really nice also. It's very thick. The way that it came in the mail was also, it was rolled up like if you were to get a poster in the mail, so it came very secured. And honestly, these are so nice, and I think that they were really worth the money. They were $39 for all eight dust jackets. 
that did not include taxes and shipping. They also do have other dust jackets for some other series. They have it for A Court of Thorns and Roses, Harry Potter, um, <sighs> Percy Jackson, some other great series if you're interested in <laughs> checking them out. This is not sponsored, just so you know. This is just me voicing my opinion and showing you guys something that I've been really excited to get in the mail. So overall, I really, really enjoyed my purchase. I think it was totally worth the $39, and I would definitely buy it again for Akatar, which I haven't read, but I would want them to match, kind of. I think eventually I will be purchasing those. And I will be doing a reading vlog of Kingdom of Ash, so look forward to that. So like I said, I am going to be finishing up Tower of Dawn. I'm almost done with that. And when I'm done with that, I plan on reading Kingdom of Ash immediately afterwards. So I'm going to try and vlog my experience finishing off the Throne of Glass series. So stay tuned for that video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.